Even at least one agency here in San Antonio that provides assistance to migrants is feeling the impact of the situation at our southern border. Catholic Charity says a surge in migrants crossing has people flooding into its migrant resource center here in San Antonio. Katrina Weber is there live on San Pedro, not far from Oblate with that story. Katrina, you mentioned earlier there appears to be an overflow of people. Are they all getting the help they want? Well, that depends on who you talk to, but let me show you there is definitely an overflow here based on what we see and what Catholic Charities, which runs the center, tells us. But we've got people all along the outside of this building. There are chairs set up for some of them. We also have people out here on the outskirts in this parking lot where I'm standing, also on the edges of this center. Now, many of the people that we've had a chance to talk to are outside. We're not allowed on the property. They say, some of them say that they've been out here for days and that they can't even get inside. There are so many people. They can't get in for the basics, things such as a shower. That's what they tell us. Now, Catholic Charity says that this is a humanitarian center, a place where migrants who are passing through this area can go for things like food, transportation, or to use a telephone. The agency says it is able to accommodate about 700 people on a normal basis. But in the past month, they've been seeing about 750 people per day show up looking for assistance. Now, there's no word on the exact reason for the surge at our border, but it does appear that it is what is creating this overflow situation here. Now, the people who I talked to here on the outskirts of the center say they're not sure when they'll even get a chance to go inside. And for some of them, they are just making their living quarters here on the sidewalk, some of them sleeping here all night. So uh, a, an overcrowded situation at this particular center, according to what we've been told, it is a result of what is happening at the border. Reporting live on the north side, Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.